Hi everybody, today I'm going to design my nails. I've already sculpted these nails in my favorite nail shape. Um, yeah, so let's get started. So I've got these two polishes uh, that, I, that I'm going to use. Um, still not quite sure about this one. I really like this color, but um, I've got you know, this is design in mind, and it works really well with this color. It also works really well with darker colors. I'm just, mm, yeah, well, we'll see. I'm just going to use this anyway, and we'll see. First, let's start with 249. It's almost the same color as uh, this cover pink. I am wearing acrylic gel by Care for Nails. I'm hoping that one coat will do. I really don't want to add a lot of bulk. Yeah, one coat will do. So this is a, a sheer nail polish, gel polish. Oh, I am sorry. I was way out of frame, I think. But yeah, so this is a sheer gel polish. So uh, Soaks has a couple of colors, uh, cover colors, um, or nude colors, I should say, like this one that are uh, pretty sheer, so you could um, apply them over your cover um, acrylic or acrylic gel, real gel, and they will just transform the color just a little bit. Maybe you think it's the pink, they've got uh, one that's more like a brownish tone or more like a dark pink, you know whatever you want all right let's get in with 104 this is a really really pretty color it its coverage is great, it's very opaque. Very pretty. So I will also just leave it at one coat. I don't know if you can see the true color on camera right now, but it's like this gorgeous plum color, like, yeah. Like it's, it, it's a pinkish purple. Yeah, I don't know. It 
It's lighter than aubergine. Right, so next I'm going to use the same color, the 249. This is going to take quite some coats, I can tell you right now, because, it's, you know, like I told you, it's pretty sheer. Second coat. So I'm gonna try and keep track of how many coats I'm using. Obviously, I could use another color, but I do want it to match. Third coat. Fourth coat. Did I say fifth or sixth? I think sixth right now. So then this would be seventh, and I think it's like one or two more coats. I don't know. Yeah, we are almost there. So this will be the last coat. If you can see what I'm doing on camera. So, um, that's done. I'm gonna go in with the Jello Cleanse. I'm just going to try and do the thinnest layer possible. Next, I'm going to go in with metallic paint and I'm going to start with the dark, yeah, pink <laughs> nails, whatever, because if I don't like the light spot that I've created in the center, I'm just going to take it straight off, you know.
So far, so good. It's not cured yet. Oh, I think. Let me just correct one bit. I've seen something I don't like. Right, now I'm happy. Let me grab my bottle of soap. And cured. That's cured. I'm a little bit worried because I thought I touched it with the brush. Sure, hoping I didn't. Oh, I didn't. Oh my god, look at that. Oh, isn't that gorgeous? Oh, wow. Oh my god, yeah, I love this so much. Get rid of all the foam. Oh, absolutely love that. Yay. So glad it worked out. Put my tub gel on top of that because um, the metallic paint won't survive without a top coat. It's going to get a little bit, I don't know. It's just not going to be pretty in about a week or so. On to the pinky. So this is just dish soap and um, just shake it real well and then I let it sit for a few seconds um, so that uh, you know the bubbles will be more more white than green because uh, the most of the soap will start to flow down again and um, it will make the bubbles better. I do prefer those small bubbles, but you know, it's no telling what you're going to get once it's on. <laughs> No big blob down here. But that's not good because that's not going to cure.
that's very pretty too. Obviously, you can do this with um, top coat over chrome, but um, I like the irony look that it has, you know, like the really, it's not chrome, it's not really yeah, like dented iron or, or something. What is that? Right, by now you must know I'm a bit crazy when it comes to liking my design, so I'm gonna just gonna start over and apply the 249 again. That's done. Next I'm gonna go in with Soak's Chrome Finish. So that's a top coat specially designed for your chrome powders let's grab some chrome oh sorry Gorgeous too. Was I out of frame again? Oh my god. Oh no, right now I'm not sure if I want to leave that chrome or not. Oh god, oh god, oh god, I really don't want to start over and do some filing again. Maybe I should just leave them chrome. Oh, what to do, what to do. Oh my god, I just don't know. Maybe I should just do the thumb and then um, I'll just see what I'm going to do. So I'm going to take my nail art glue. Um,
so that's cured. Let me grab some. Come on. That's pretty too, huh? Mm. What to do, what to do? Do I want this? That's pretty too, but do I want it next to these? Or am I gonna leave it like that? That's cool too, huh? Just leave it like that, maybe? Yeah, I've decided I'm just gonna leave it like that. Just apply some top coat. If um, I was to do this on a client, I would apply rubber base first. Just to be sure that I won't go and chip. I don't know if I was out of frame again. I don't know what's wrong with me today. And here are my nails. So I am happy with how they turned out. I am happy that I left these two crumb. And I do like the effect of this one. So just, you know. And I love that. I think that is so awesome. Yeah, so I'm really happy how they came out. These are my other nails. I've already been wearing them for a week. Still doing good. And obviously I've changed this one. Now I was really happy how the um, uh, tank came out, but I really like my special nail shape and I had to make it like a oval stiletto kind of shape because it looked weird with the tank on top and um yeah you know it was pretty but it just is it was it just wasn't me so i decided to take it off and do the same as these two but you know um yeah it's fine so two completely different hands but i'm really happy with them so um yeah Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you like this video and I wish you all a very good day. Goodbye.